Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Creative Careers. In today's topic, we are going to talk about Bachelor of Planning and what is Bachelor of Planning, how it is different from Bachelor of Architecture, which is BARC. And let's see what are the eligibility colleges and how you can move forward in this field. So planning, planning, uh, we do planning in everything from our daily routine, we plan. We plan our uh, tours, we plan our some schedules and all. In the same way, we plan human settlement and whatever needed for the human settlement like housing, the gardens, urban area, there is a lot of settlement issue with the cities like Bombay and all, slum settlement. So this all will come in the planning. So there is a course particularly for this which is called as Bachelor of Planning. In this, this is a four-year course, whereas Architecture is a five-year course. It is a four-year course with eight semesters and you will be designated as a, as a planner, like urban planner, town planner and all these sort of specializations are there. So this course eligibility, you need to be 12 passed out from any stream, either from science, commerce or arts. Uh, it's not like particularly like you should be from science but one thing is you should have maths as a subject uh, when you are in 10 plus till 10 plus 2 and you should score more than 50% in maths and more than 50% in overall your percentage so next is which are the exams you need to give as I said for JE means second paper for most top colleges including SPA Delhi, SEPT University and all all these have bachelor of planning courses and uh, next is UPS double E, which is UP state entrance exam. TNACET is the state entrance exam for Tamil Nadu. And also there are few colleges which will directly uh, take you in uh, from your percentile and marks. And there are few colleges which will take individual exam, particularly like VIT and all. And there are few colleges which will invite you and take interview of you if you want to join this course. So colleges, as I said, even IIT Kharagpur has Bachelor of Planning, but for IIT you need to clear your uh, mains and then advance and after that uh, you have certain kind of interview and uh, you have colleges like uh, SPA Delhi which means School of Planning and Architecture. All the SPAs have planning, SPA Bhopal, there is Maulana Azad uh, College. Uh, and there is college in uh, NIT Patna has Bachelor of Planning. There are many top colleges including private like lovely professional university and all. These have Bachelor of Planning. And what we do in this course? Uh, in this course, you actually study about urban settlements and how settlements are made. Like uh, you will study sociology, you will study community like uh, you will study the transport system you will try to solve the problem of the transportation traffic and connectivity issues within the city and out of the city like ring roads and all you will plan like where should be the airport where should be if you if your city has a beach or if your city has a port where should be the seaports and all where should be your uh, main market area all these you will study in this like you will study it from the past uh, like which is the main central point of the city there are uh, places called as landmarks nodes where people will meet a lot so all these you will study you will understand that city or the township and then you will move for next uh, one so here like you will understand how are the payments are working what can you do more to implement uh, more payments and uh, how can you make even wheelchairers, uh, wheelchair persons use that uh, payment or footpath and how can you make zebra crosses more efficient and how to control traffic. Everything related to an urban settlement or a regional settlement you will study in this course. You will study things like how communities work. You cannot place a temple in the Muslim community area, right? That only happens in the army campus, I know. But uh, you will place it somewhere within where Hindu region people stay. And you will, uh, in the like, uh, in the olden cities, there are like, uh, there are actually spaces like the spaces for Hindu people, the spaces for Muslim people and all. I'm not dividing and all and please don't take it as a offense. I'm just telling you will, 
because those people require the temple more often so in such way you plan so planners do this planners understand what the need of that community there and they will plan accordingly so planners actually plan it on a sheet okay next person who are going to build and take in force are like even architects do the next job and uh, the engineers do the next job like civil engineers but planners plan everything they understand they analyze they and in this course also you need drafting skills you have to draft you have to make models as you used to do in architecture but models here will be like in a very large scale you will make box kind of models in architecture you used to make a detail model of single building here you make model of entire town like you will you will put layouts like where our different roads will come how they will combine you will literally make huge maps of a township and all in this uh so they are like industrial towns so the char tata's town the jamshedpur which is like a industrial town it's a planned city then there is there are many different like chandigarh was a planned city by corbusier and uh, you have amravati in recently where you will plan where should be the housing part of it where should be the market places where all different kind of things of a city should come a settlement should come and combine like where should be the airport how convenient it is for the users to use in that space all these aspects we study in it so we'll make the note of what was there in a in the past and how we can what is there in the present and how we can make it better in the future so all this about city about settlement about human behavior in different spaces you will study in bachelor of planning so bachelor of planning is a great course uh, and in this course you get lot of government jobs as well this is one of the pros in this pros of this course and this course has a very huge uh, a huge future because everyone needs a planning uh, planning and most of the population is moving to urban areas so we need to understand how to settle everyone in a city how to maintain the resources how we can uh, like you will understand subjects like geology and hydrology in this uh, so water problem how to conserve water environment how we can conserve with so much of population in urban areas how we can how we can make them environmentally effective all this you will study in this and in this course has uh, many people do masters in planning after they complete bachelors in architecture so those people have lot of lot of like uh, you know, what you can say you will be having the idea of all the thing overall aspect so many people choose to do that you can do masters in planning after bachelors in planning you can do something called as transportation design once you are done with bachelors in planning if you are interested to reduce the tra traffic problems and all so this all is called as bachelors of planning if you have more doubts on anything or, or if you are watching till a video till this please like share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any doubts please let me know in the comment section and if you want to know more about these kind of creative courses different courses please let me know in the comment section thank you